Hello! This is Somza again, and welcome to more Eldritch. So last time we played, uh, we... We had some trouble getting through the second level, so... We are still not done with this one. And uh, because we died, we naturally lost everything we got. That includes all of our extra health, so now we're back to 3 health. And... Uh, I mentioned that we might want to try the Halloween level because there is some interesting stuff that you can get from the Halloween level and we are probably going to visit all of these levels at some point anyway. Uh, we l luckily we made some progress so we got some stuff into our bank so we are not completely like um, we're not poor. We we still have money and we we, we can buy our stuff back. But let's let's do the Halloween level. So first of all, this level is is extremely extremely difficult, and that's one of the things. But that's why I decided to come here without any stuff. So we are we're doing we're going to do one run here. If we if I fail, then we are just going to go back to the uh, go back to the like. Uh, uh, the second level, and we are just going to do a run there without any extra stuff. But if we can get some stuff from here, I'd be very happy. Because this level has, like, I think some of these, like, items are exclusive. And there are also some exclusive, like, powers, I think that we are definitely going to find it very useful, but we need to be very careful because not everything in here is the way it seems. And especially this, that bubbling is very disturbing because that can, that can mean that there is a Shoggoth around here. And those guys are very nasty. Yep, that's a, that's a Shoggoth. So that guy is once again it's invulnerable so we can't we can't do much about him. And well he is quite fast, he does a lot of damage. So we definitely don't want to mess with that guy. But I do want to mess with this guy. And I have a pickaxe at the moment. Okay, so that's a that's another shog off. So what I'm trying to do here is I'm trying to figure out a way that I can use that is relatively safe and also give, gives me access to all of the important stuff I need. Don't fall down, don't fall down. Also this pickaxe is a very powerful weapon. Uh, and uh, it's only like... It's only... Like, uh, downside is that you need to wait a moment before you can strike with it, so it's a bit slower. But other than that, it's basically perfect. It does a lot of damage, it can kill basically everything with a single blow. Except all the, of course, all the invulnerable stuff. Like the Shoggoths, and we have a lot of Shoggoths here. If we had had luck, we could have seen a Shoggoth on the first level, but I think I missed the Shoggoth room back there. It's also possible that maybe he didn't spawn at all. Okay, this guy is getting suspicious. Uh, that's not good. That's not good at all. Luckily we have plenty of these fruit bushes around here. Don't come here. I taste very bad. I'm not sure what what Shoggoths do, but I imagine it's not something I want to experience. Alright, oh, it's actually the hatchet that's the powerful weapon. I forgot. What the pickaxe does is the pickaxe allows you to dig through walls. It's also very useful. Of course, it also breaks after a while, but 
uh, the hatchet should be the one that does more damage. And I now have a rock. I don't want a rock. Okay. So, um, we have a pickaxe here. So let's let's do that and take the pickaxe. That way we may be able to access this area. Okay, and that's a... Uh, there's nothing here. You can just ignore me. Like that, yeah. Good little cultist. Just go away and I will take... Okay, so this is the cloak power, so I, I can cloak myself now. And this is one of the good powers. And this is the reason why I wanted to come here, because we can use these powers. And also, destroying these pumpkins gives us a bunch of... Uh, 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 a bunch of these. What were these? I I I I completely blanked out. Oh, artifacts. And also, if you hit those, uh, yeah, if you hit the dynamite, it it will explode. And that's naturally going to cause some noise. So I'm being extra careful about the shug off. Oh, a key. That's good. A grappling gun is also a very nice, very nice weapon. What this does is you can fire off these, like, ropes and you can climb on them. One of the game developers of this game was a Thief fan. Well, actually, I think this is made by only one person, so... Yeah. But anyway, he was a Thief fan, so I... You can probably guess where he got the inspiration for this gun from. Oh, that's the Shoggoth. I need to go one level deeper. Okay. Let's do... No, 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 no. How about no? How about no? No. Okay. Once again, the exit should be on the lowest level. It's going to take us some thinking to get to it, though. Okay, let's break this. Take all the artifacts. We've already gotten a bunch of artifacts, because this is this is basically a level where you can grind to get a bunch of artifacts and other equipment. There's also some health in there. I probably want to grab that health. Oh, that's a Shoggoth. I don't want to mess with the Shoggoth. Okay, he's walking around here. I'm still hoping that he he hasn't seen us. Because if those guys see you, you're in big trouble. I'm going to cloak myself just quickly and get all of this stuff so I, I am invisible for the moment. Okay, this is not good. Yeah, walk in here. Walk in here. And I can ask you a question. Okay, that's an old one. Don't want to use that one. I'm also not going to loot these guys. Oh, and by the way, <laughs> you probably already noticed it, but for some reason I was being ignorant. But they have pumpkins for heads. And that's just the... Halloween stuff. A tripwire gun? Nope. Not gonna have that. Okay. So far so good. Yeah, there's nothing here. And this this cloaking power actually might be very useful. I wonder if it use uh, if it can be used against these statues on the second level. Because I don't want to switch to anything else. Ha. Huh. So even if these guys see me. It doesn't matter, I can still kill them with one blow. And the lower we go, the more Shoggoths we should start to see. 
so let's be extra careful. There's like a Shoggoth either up there or behind that wall. And I don't really want to find out. So there's a bunch of pumpkins, some keys and stuff. This is definitely good stuff. And yeah, that's good. Now let's see what's down there. Luckily I can probably use the cloaking power against these Shoggoths. So if I get caught by a Shoggoth, I can run away with the cloaking power. I do, I do sort of want to get the... Okay, I'm going to just cloak myself. I'm not going to uh, run because I don't want to cause any noise. But I will definitely cloak. Okay, th so there's a Shogoth up there. Okay, I didn't want to do that. I want my hatchet back. Even though I'm using this fairly expensive ability, I am still getting tons of profits. Okay, let's head this way. Maybe I should save this power until I actually get caught. And then use it, because it seems to work that way as well. Okay, yeah, I, I got caught. Don't tell me the... Okay, good. So the Shoggoth can see the invisible. Okay, let's see what's inside these houses. A bunch of artifacts, which is good for me. And naturally we can carry all of this stuff into... Uh, into the next level. Okay. Let's be careful. It sounds like there's something up, like here. You saw nothing? Not there. Wow. It's a Shoggoth army. <laughs> Fine. I'll do it this way then. Screw you guys. Okay, we need to find the exit. Because I'm, I'm already quite happy about all of my loot. So if I can just... Get all of my stuff and get out of here, I'd be very happy. Of course, I do want to keep all of my stuff, so... Uh, that's the priority number one. Uh, technically I don't really need the uh, grappling, uh, grappling gun, because I I have the cloak power, so I don't need to do any like real escapes. I only really need to... Hmm. I guess technically I could probably pick up the dynamite. Let's actually run back there. I'm not too worried about the Shoggoths at the moment, they are sort of behind behind bars, behind walls. Okay, that's good enough. So, let's blow up, like, this wall. 
And don't tell me there's a... Yep. I should have... Should have thought about that. <laughs> 